A week ago, we bought a camper van and decided to take it to New Brighton State Beach in Capitola, California. This is our first camping trip with our van. This would sadly be our beloved Roscoe's last trip as he became sick and passed away exactly a week later. He was only 10 and a half years old. This video is dedicated to our sweet boy Roscoe. We are taking the Revel out for the first time today. We are going to New Brighton Beach. We're on our way to New Brighton Beach in Capitola right now to go camping. Is this considered the maiden voyage? This yeah, is right? the pre-maiden voyage. Pre. Okay. Taking it out for a night just to learn the systems and just get settled in and then a couple of weeks is the main point. Yeah, but we're so excited. We're all packed up. We're gonna test out our little storage features we've made and other little gadgets we brought and make note of what we didn't need, what we do still need to get and we're excited. Maddie's taking her nap. We'll see you soon. We decided to take our family for a short one night camping trip which is only 45 minutes from our home. It's in the city of Capitola, which is 7 miles south of Santa Cruz and 38 miles north of Monterey. It was a nice sunny day in January, but this was considered the slow season. We made our reservation on the recreation.gov website about a week prior. Because it was a Thursday, there was a lot of availability. The premium spots were all booked, so we chose the closest site to the viewpoints. Some sites offered water and power hookups, but ours didn't. Our site was Site 89. We just arrived at New Brighton State Beach. This is the first time we took the Revel out. So uh, right now we're gonna get something to eat. Bought some tacos from a local taco shop. And uh, then we're gonna walk around and check the campgrounds out. Each site has a picnic table and fire pit and just a short walk from the beach. We were surrounded by beautiful trees and Madison had a ton of space to run around. Named after the famous seaside resort in England, the beach offers hiking trails, campground, and sweeping views of Monterey Bay. The beach is just a short walk from the campground. There are two trails that lead to the beach, but one was closed for the season, so we had to make the longer walk down Sunset Trail. We wanted to see the sunset, but it was a cloudy day. The sky was still beautiful, and the weather was great for January. There weren't many people, and we had the beach all to ourselves. Let's get dinner started. We got some rice going. We have the steaks on the grill. And we gotta feed this little baby. It's the end of the day. So this is what our van looks like at night, right before we go to bed. We just finished taking a shower. So front seat, storage. Here's our car seat for Madison. Random stuff on that side. Felt bins for our clothes and Madison's toys. Oh, stuck. <laughs> Fail. <laughs> That's a fail. I'm stuck on your foot. <laughs> Passenger seat, hamper, jackets, jackets. Kitchen's pretty clean earlier. There was a lot of dishes, but Amanda did them. So, thank you. You're welcome. Bathroom. Amanda installed this curtain with uh, using magnetic hooks. Let's see what it looks like in there. There they are. Where's Maddie? <laughs> hey girl, are you ready for bed? 
<laughs> okay. Close that curtain. Right underneath the bed is Roscoe. Hey, buddy. Man, his food's right there. Random stuff on the sides. Extra water. But the bottom of the bed is Roscoe's. In la caja. Ponte tu libro en la caja. Sí, grande. Ponte tus juguetes aquí. Madison and Amanda are still sleeping right now, but I had to get up early and uh, see the sunrise. I looked out the window and uh, I saw the sky it was absolutely stunning. So had to get out and had to check it out. So this is New Brighton Beach in the morning. We decided to go to Capitola Village before we went home. This is a great place to hang out on the beach or if you just want to grab a bite to eat. There are plenty of restaurants and boutique shops in the village. When we're here, we always stop at Pizza My Heart. Our go-to is the Big Sur. It's their combination pizza. We also get the Hawaiian and yes, pineapple belongs on pizza. I'm using a fork and a knife. Mmm, good? <laughs> the day isn't complete until you get some ice cream. We went to Polar Bear Creamery. They have a pretty big selection here and we opted for the Sundays. If you're in the area, make sure you check them out. They will not disappoint. <laughs> 